My name is Anaïs, I come from France, south of France, from Toulouse. And this is my first year of a Master in Biodiversity, Conservation and Restoration. I try to be more involved uh, in what is happening now in our world. And uh, I really want to, uh, to make a change and I really want to uh, discover what we can do to, um, to improve our way of living and improve the quality of life. I love plants since I'm a child, just because when you take care of them, they give you a nice surprise at the end, it's a flower. And this is just a start uh, of uh, how you act in the world, because we need also to save the planet. And this, is, this just starts with a little action like that. I go to university by bike, because when I arrived here, I just uh, learned that we have to have a bike here in Antwerp, it's really useful. Everything is accessible, so I am just living 10 minutes from the university and 10 minutes from the city centre. Also with my uh, studies, environmental, uh, environmental science, uh, I have to go by bike, of course, I cannot take the car, it's not uh, ecological thinking. I studied biomedical science before in the UK and I realized that the human has a lot of impact on the earth and uh, I arrived here to be more uh, specific about the uh, climate change studies. We learn how to uh, apply our knowledge, science knowledge, with uh, the society, with uh, legal treaties and European laws for example. And uh, this is really important, actually. I didn't realize before uh, that uh, there is, uh, if we want to achieve something in science, we also need to work with other people, uh, like governmental agency, for example. Biodiversity loss is a serious challenge, globally and locally. What we want to do with this program is to train students to become scientists who can analyze the underlying causes of this loss of biodiversity and who can provide scientifically based solutions um, for new policies that can either mitigate the loss of biodiversity or conserve the biodiversity that's still there or even restore biodiversity. We provide the students with a strong theoretical background but we also let them taste of all the practicalities of this work. As part of the programme, we want students to perform an internship in a number of institutions and organisations that we carefully select, and where students can get first-hand experience of what it means in reality to do priority setting or decision making in biodiversity conservation and restoration. We can go abroad working for a specific uh, habitat, for example, wetlands or grasslands. It can be in an Arctic area or in a tropical forest. For example, next summer I will go to French Guiana for my master project with um, PLECO, it's a research group. The University of Antwerp has selected a limited number of consortia of excellence. One of them is the Consortium of Excellence Global Change Ecology. This program draws on all the expertise and the network that exists around this consortium. We also collaborate with the research center of the Antwerp Zoo, which is one of the European leaders in species conservation, whether it be in the field or in captive populations in zoos. During a certain moment, yes. Now that I get to know Belgian people, I feel more integrated and I have more friendship with them. They are really open people and now we are forming a big group. So I'm really happy about that. We try to say water company in Dutch. Water maatschappij. Water maatschappij. Maatschappij. Ah, it's a water company. It's a water company. I just know some little words, but. Um, Oh, can you say hello and, 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 and like? Uh, they mostly you? say "dag," or when you when you go out, you say like uh, "salut." But actually, this comes yeah. from a French word. <laughs>
really enjoy living in Antwerp. It's a really rich city um, regarding the cultures. When I walk around in, on the streets, I can see a lot of uh, nice architectures, nice buildings. What I also really like is uh, in Antwerp they mix uh, art and nature, like here in the Middelheim Park. And I never saw that before. Probably it exists in other places, but uh, here it's uh, close to my university and my flat. And Antwerp is a big city, but there is a lot of uh, park or forest where you can breathe and have uh, fresh air. Students should come to Antwerp, of course, for the beer and the chocolate, but also, like every master, also international students can continue with a PhD program, and there's a very strong PhD program at the University of Antwerp. But students who finish this master are also ready to go to all kinds of NGOs, organizations and institutions here and abroad, which are concerned with biodiversity, conservation and restoration. When I finish my master, I can uh, work in Belgium uh, in relation with other research groups that have uh, also connection with international organization. And also we are really uh, close to Brussels here in Antwerp. Especially in Brussels, we are dealing with a politician uh, where all the decisions are made every day about conservation and restoration. So I'm really proud to be part of this master and I will have a lot of opportunity later.